Okay, and we're back with uh, Xenoblade with uh, Dunben and oh, sweet initiate battle. Oh wow! Allows ordinary weapons to damage the mech on. That's actually a good ability. And I, I probably won't have to use it at all, but it is a good ability. Let's take all of these. Yeah. I love I love in the beginning of RPGs like this where they give you really good weapons just just in the beginning like like they give you like like Tella in Final Fantasy IV um, like just a really good character and I didn't want to go to the save I wanted to and let's see if he can equip the pike nope of course not soldier pike um. Nah, um, wait, 279, what do I have equipped? It might, it might be better. It might be better. Yeah, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll actually do this. Wait, two seconds. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm actually going to do this, just because it seems so much more powerful by default. Okay. Oh. That's right. No mercy. Yeah, I just love the taste of power. Just, like, like, don't you wish you were this powerful throughout the whole game? Wouldn't that be awesome? I mean, the camera's acting up a bit. And it's really dark right now. Yeah, let's, just, let's just explore a little. Why not? I see nothing wrong with it. I mean, it, it's gonna ha it's gonna it's really gonna suck going back to uh to level eleven characters without the Minato after this. Like, I just wish, I wish I could keep this guy in my party a bit longer, you know? <laughs> but, uh, what's her face? Fiora is going to be incredibly underleveled by the time we get to her. Uh, by the time she rejoins the party, isn't she? And that's not going to be too good. Let's do a little bit more exploring. Just for uh, no, because you know while we while we have while we have uh, Dunban in our party. Oh, it's daytime! Yay! I mean, and all this loot we're getting, guys. It's Worth it. Just... Not bad. 
I mean, now now it's understandable why in the beginning everyone's like, oh, this guy with the sword is going to beat all these guys with cannons and stuff and make them our bitch. Because the sword is incredibly good. <laughs> are, we, are we not attacking for some reason? Why? Okay, apparently uh, the game's doing that thing where, where we don't attack certain people. Oh, because they're off busy. Because they're busy doing this. Okay. Where, where, where was that guy who did the thing? Oh well. Let's take out all these guys. Okay. like getting equipment. Equipment's always a nice drop, isn't it? It's always nice when you get an equipment drop. Okay, but uh, now I actually go in the direction we're supposed to. Or not. <laughs> Got distracted by more baddies, sorry. better if like the uh the mechons actually ganged up against us and we don't have to keep on just fighting one at a time actually that'd be nice oh sweet that leveled up cool um genuine okay yeah i don't know why i was reading that I mean, i'm gonna take all of it anyway Okay. Uh, any, did I miss anything around here? Yes, no. Ooh, a staircase. Oh yeah, this guy. Okay, now going where we're supposed to again. Okay. Okay. Good, good. Let's see, you know, I mean, these guys are attacking us, so we might as well exterminate all of them, right? I mean, if I left one here, he'd just kill everybody anyway, so it's it's not worth it to leave any of them live. Leave any of them alive. Let any of them live, yeah. No! Oh. Sword too powerful. 
Plot demands I give it up for tension. You can't take any more of the Monado. But I must. I don't have a choice. Oh, shit. Right, right. You can't go on like this. Shock. That bad. Does Shulk look up the Monado? Oh no, what, what is Shulk doing? This was totally unpredictable. What a twist. Teach that sort who's boss, Shulk. It's, it's kind of like when catching a Pokemon, you know? It's like the ball is shaking and you're waiting, can I capture it? Will this Pokemon obey me? That's kind of like what Shulk must be feeling right now. Just waiting, the ball. It, it turns to one side. Boom. Turns to the other side. Boom. And then you wait for the third turn. It always takes the longest. It turns again, boom, and then you wait for the ball to go dark, and it does. The ball goes dark, and you realize you finally caught Mewtwo, and you're like, yay! And then you realize you used a Master Ball, so it wasn't even like, you know, there, there, there wasn't any doubt. <laughs> oh shit, he's like getting premonitions of the future. Yeah, he's just like dodging things. He's using foresight. He's using his spider senses. <laughs> That's what it is. My spider senses. They were all tingly. Okay, um, I'm just gonna take a bet that, um, Dunban will become jealous and get all Riku on, uh, on Shulk because Riku is like, I'm the true Minato master, and now Shulk is because something, something dark side. Okay. So Shulk has the thing now, so let's make him the main. main character. And uh let's let's see equipment now. And while we're empty slot. Let's give Minato these gem thingies. Uh da -da, okay. Okay. Um, and I have no more gems, that's right, okay. Uh, we got new gloves, right? Uh, hmm. Yeah, let's do this. And, uh, we didn't get any new pants or nothing, right? Hmm. But we got new shoes, and those are really good shoes. Okay. And now, uh, it's 5733. Yeah, let's give them these shoes. And, uh, Okay, and uh, da -da, dun, dun, dun. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, yeah. And then I kind of want to oh, activate Monado.
Um, Okay, cool. Now I kind of want to save, actually. Oh, I can't save in this area. Oh, my, because I'm in the green ring still. That's right, okay. Okay. Cool. Can I save yet? Yes, I can save now. Good. Okay, cool. And uh, looks like this this little demo thing will go on another part because we still haven't gotten to a good place. Or maybe we have, you know. Uh, yeah, actually, yeah. Uh, Shulk has gotten the Monado. Uh, the town is under attack. If uh, you want to see where the story goes from here, um, I definitely recommend picking up the game. Um, apparently, from what everyone is saying, who's played through it, uh, it is one of the best JRPGs ever made. Completely revolutionizes the uh, revolutionizes the genre. Um, from what I've played of it, I think it's a pretty damn good game. Um, as you can see, the battle system is very nuanced, very innovative. Um, it seems like a really big game, just a uh, sense of scale wise, um, and it just, uh, it seems really good, everyone's saying it's really good, so if you want to see more of it, go pick it up and play it for yourself. I've been Dash Roll Rush, I'm, uh, glad that you joined me for this little adventure into the Xenoblade Chronicles, and, um, I'll review the game when I'm fully done beating it, if that ever happens, because I hear it's incredibly long, but, uh, yeah, when I beat it, I should review it and tell you guys what I think of the rest of the game instead of just the three hours, three and a half hours I have played of it. So, um, I hope you enjoyed. I hope you pick up the game if it's to your liking. Uh, don't pirate it or anything because um, we asked for this game to be brought to the shores. We should actually buy it, you know, and show our support. Uh, put our money where our mouth is. So, yeah, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I enjoyed myself, and uh, I will see you guys later. Maybe. If I decide to do any more of these types of videos for maybe a different game. Wink. Good night, everyone.